Hello everyone, my name is Farukun and today and today I'll be unboxing a new mouse that I bought for myself. So I bought this mouse because my previous mouse was causing a small problem for me. My previous mouse was a Alcatraz X Craft Twilight 2000. It's this one. This mouse. Uh, there you go. Alcatraz X Craft Twilight 2000. It's supposedly a gaming mouse, but it's a very basic gaming mouse. Only has six buttons: uh, left click, right click, scroll wheel, DPI changer, and then the two side buttons. Yeah. So uh, this mouse works fine. It's very light. So if you're interested in a hefty mouse, you don't want this one, unless you make some changes inside, like put some weights in, in there. But it's a very nice mouse. Very smooth work. It works very smooth. Uh, it lights up really well, changes colors, so that's a really nice aesthetic part of the mouse. The DPI changes are really useful when you're playing FPS or League of Legends, uh, different games, so that's very nice. I'm, I also use it to do some minor graphical editing and stuff. So I, I'm actually really satisfied with this old mouse of mine, but the problem with it is that it's a it's a classic mouse. It makes a lot of noise when you're clicking. So, this is like this. It makes a hell of a lot of clicking noise, and that's a problem when I'm playing League of Legends or any other MOBA. Even FPS games, actually, like Team Fortress 2. Team Fortress 2. Um, it makes a lot of noise, so when I'm playing, I wake up the people here in my house. They can hear me clicking away into the night, and yeah, so that's not really nice. So, uh, what I decided to do was to hunt down this old mouse, old, old wireless mouse that I used to have. It's called the Elephant Milky, I think. I think it's called Milky, uh, or Milk Series. Yeah, it's made by Elephant, it's wireless, wireless, and it's a silent mouse, meaning no clicking sounds. Unfortunately, Data Blitz, the store that I always frequent for my um, computer peripherals, uh, didn't have it in stock. I saw it about two months ago, but I didn't want to buy it just yet because I just bought the X-Craft mouse. But so, uh, but now they're out of stock. But fortunately, they have a silent mouse, another silent mouse model in stock, and that is this one. This is the Elephant Sasquatch vers version 2.0 silent blue sensor mouse. So. It's a silent wheel mouse, uh, optical mouse that goes from 800 to 2400 dpi. Uh, it's a silent operating mouse meaning no clicking noise. Very quiet and uh, it's an XL size so it's it's bigger, slightly bigger, no wait, it's way bigger. Way bigger than my, uh, than my X-Craft so that's gonna be an interesting thing. Uh, it has a 1.8 meter ultra long cable apparently and then uh, it's only the mouse inside no mouse pad like the xcraft the xcraft came with a bonus mouse pad that isn't exactly all that special but it's free so that's nice comes this thing the sasquatch comes in two different colors black and white and gray i chose the black one because i uh, i'm not a big fan of white peripherals because it, they get dirty quite easily. Um, what else? It ha it also has six buttons. So left click, ri left click, right click, scroll wheel, left click, right click, scroll wheel, DPI, and then the side buttons. And I got it from Data Blitz at only four ninety five. Uh, yeah, four ninety five. That's about ten dollars. Four ninety five pesos, Philippine pesos. Uh, that's about ten dollars. Uh, so it's a basically a budget mouse. Uh, nothing big. So without further ado, let's open up this thing. Oh, all right. So here's the new mouse. Uh, it says there the Elephant Sasquatch version version 2.0 silent um, blue sensor mouse uh, made by Elephant. I've tried a few of their mouses before, and all of them work pretty well. Uh, what's in the box is mouse test there only mouse windows 8 7 vista or xp 
um, it doesn't say Windows 10 so I'm a bit worried about that but the XCraft also didn't say Windows 10 so and it worked fine with my computer so I'm hoping this works just as well if it doesn't I'm bringing it back and asking for a replacement uh, 1.8 meter ultra long cable yeah right there and then what else does it say here's the sample colors um, silent wheel DPI is from 800 to 2400 yeah. silent operation it's a QR code there 495 only only 10 bucks basically alright so let's open it um, damn it I need to get this So you have to push in this thing, the handle inside, so that it actually releases the thing, the whole thing. Oh, you don't actually have to. All right. Oh well, you just pull it from the bottom. So uh, that's a handy tip. Handy tip for those who are want to get this kind of mouse. Ah, very nice. The box comes with this a soft uh, foam thing that nestles the mouse quite well. It does seem like a really huge mouse, so... Alright. Let's, let's try to get it out of the box. Uh, yeah. Alright. So here's the mouse. It says elephant right there. You can see it. Uh, six buttons, left, bu left click, right click, mouse wheel. Uh, quiet mouse wheel. Even the DPI is quiet, always quiet actually. And the side buttons are also quiet. Wait a second. Yeah, it's relatively more quiet. Yeah, so. Um, I'm gonna, let's get rid of this wrapping here. Alright. So a really long cable, it has this re somehow real fairly cool uh, USB uh, connector. So kind of reminds me of the connector for my um, Dragonov headset, but a little bit more generic. Silver plated, so the mouse has a strange shape to it, it's like that. So there's kind of like a jawline right, right there for two but uh, protruding jawline right there. It says Elephant Sasquatch model WM uh, assembly in China. So you know what to expect. But most of Elephant's products are really nice. Um, let's try demonstrating the clicking. So this is the X Craft. Not sure if you can hear it. I'll put it right next to my headset because that's where the mic is. So here's the Elephant. Minimal noise, and here's the X graph. Yeah, so really uh, quite a little bit more silent than the uh, regular mouse, so that's really nice. I miss that kind of my mouse. Uh, I think the wireless, the Elephant Milk series, is a little bit more quiet, but this should work out well for me as well. All right. So, here's a side-by-side -side comparison of the two mouse, mice, or if you, that's how you want to deal with it. So, oh my god, that's so sick. I just noticed, it actually glows. So, this mouse glows, uh, the, uh, the elephant mouse glows and changes color. So, that's a really nice touch, although, oh wait, hold on. Yeah, that's a really nice touch. Um, although not, that's the only part of the mouse that glows, but it's still nice to have that. Um, let's compare it to the X-Craft. Uh, I'm gonna plug in the X-Craft real quick. Hold on. Um, here's the X-Craft. Yeah, the X-Craft also glows. Uh, the entire mouse actually glows and changes color. And it actually mixes colors up from time to time, like that. It becomes 
a mix of white and blue. Now it's dark blue, which is in with white. So really sweet looking mouse, but it is rather noisy. So that's something to look out for. Um, here's the uh, elephant mouse again, and yeah, very nice. Changes colors as well. Not as flashy as the X Craft, but uh, not bad. The X Craft, the elephant mouse is uh, way bigger than the X Craft mouse that I got used to. So it's kind of a different feel. Really huge. The protruding part here at the lower left of the mouse kind of makes it awkward to hold. It's kind of like a bulge that's hitting me right here. But if you position your hand correctly, it, it actually feels quite okay. Uh, if you put, uh, if you position your hand a little bit too low, you won't be able to hold. The, uh, you won't be able to press the side button, so that's gonna be a problem. So, but just just I'll, I'll just have to get used to holding it a little bit higher up. Uh, with regards to weight, the they're about the same, but I guess the uh, large size of the elephant makes it a, li a little bit more heavy, especially on the rear end part. Um, the mouse is smooth and it it works fine. Um, I'm using it right now to for the recording, so I'll show you that. Um, yeah, see the mouse is okay. Right click, left click to make it go away. Um, oh, yeah. So my the um, the la uh, the side buttons work really nice. Right click gets rid of the. I had I had it set to get rid of all the windows. Left click is the Alt tab, so it works well. Okay, so the scroll wheel also works fine, uh, I think. And the GPI settings, yeah, perfect. Works perfectly. Can't really display the GPI and the scroll wheel properly, but uh, they do seem to work just fine. Alright, so that's all for now. Thank you for watching this unboxing video of the Elephant version 2.0 silent blue sensor mouse. It is uh, $10, about $10, for 95 Filipino pesos, Philippine pesos, and I got a Data Blitz SM North EDSA, if you know where that is, or if you're not from the Philippines, uh, but you know where to get this one, yeah, that's about the price of it. Uh, very nice, uh, decent mouse, no sounds, and uh, a bit, a bit large and awkwardly shaped, but it's, I think it's just something that would take some getting used to. So that's all for now and hope to be able to unbox more uh, devices for you guys and see you in the next video. Bye.